You guys are absolutely synced. You're playing like one man. Yeah, you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. We need to socialize with other human beings, bro. I swear, this is not good, dude. We're gonna, it's mental asylum cleave right now happening. <laughs> it's gotta be unhealthy. Yeah, can't be good for you. <laughs> it can't be good for you. I don't know, man. Maybe this is not good for the chat as well, man. You guys are sounding a little bit schizo as well, man. I'm not gonna lie. I play better when I'm talking to myself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you, got you, got you. You wanna go shaman? You wanna go shaman? I tricked you, I tricked you, I tricked you, go! No way he doesn't trigger that. Okay, okay, we got Link, we got Link, we got Link, can reset? There's no way we can win this, bro. I got a Riptide! Oh, right before I died. Sorry, bro, I had to respond to, uh, yeah, she's... Uh, I, I don't know, dude. Bro, you gotta play it cool, man. Like, what are you doing, bro? Insta-responding, mid-arena game, man. Get your shit together, dude. Uh, y it is what it is. Hello, boys. Zico back again with more Schizo Cleave. However, there has been an important escalation of the intro to this video. CS Hero has decided to stop playing with Zico for a while as quote unquote, it's tiring being the best to ever do it and needs a break from the previous arguments. Since then, Zico has delved back into the depths of trade chat and found a mage by the name of Adeliman, whom Zico can only describe as a mage with identical IQ and plays like himself, quite literally. What can go wrong? Anyway, enjoy. All right, so the only way I can beat this is by... First, we have to dodge this aids. The only way I've ever been able to beat this so far with double mage was a game where I just opened on my fire mage and stacked up a big combust and spread it. So that's what we're gonna do. Maybe not. Unbeatable. <laughs> I need to go on the priest, I feel like, with this comp. You guys think this guy's panicking? With his fucking disrespect? You guys think this guy's panicking, chat? I'm not gonna lie, bro, that, that entangling roots was extremely disrespectful. And I don't know if you've been paying attention, bro. I don't like being disrespected. I take that shit personal. He's still the R. Disrespect? Why would he disrespect? Why wouldn't he just take the win? Why would he chat? Explain to me why the hell did this guy just disrespect me like this? Why did he just disrespect me like that? Did you guys see that entangling roots he did? Look at that. Does he know who he's disrespecting? Let's take a look at that disrespect again. This is exactly where this man fucked up. Right here, right here is where, this is where the ego is coming in. This is where the laughter is happening. Oh my God, this guy is rank one. Psh, this was the easiest game ever. Lol, these guys are trash. And then right here, we're popping everything. The bell is proking. And what does he do? What does he do? What does he do? He has a proc. I have no trinket. He can just clone me right now, and the game is won. And he knows he can just clone me right now, and the game is won. But in his head, the game is already won. The game is already won, so why would he clone me? Why would he try hard? 
when he can just disrespect. And instead of sending the clone, he sends the root on the deep freeze with the full bang up. That guy goes for the disrespect. And it's right here where he's like, oh, fuck. He's like, ah, it's fine. I got this. And now, and now he's like, ah, it's fine. It's fine. I got this. This is where the copium starts kicking in. This is where the, co the copium is like, ah, don't worry about it, bro. He's like, ah, oh, ah, uh, ah, uh, shit. What do we do? What do we do? What do we do at this point? At this point, he's, uh, the copium is like, it's starting to be replaced with fear. He knows his priest is about to leave the group. He spent hours finding this guy in trade chat. He knows the YouTube video is gonna be lit. He knows might even be some uh, Asmon Gold reacts on it. It's happened before. Anything is possible. And this is where the, the fear starts to take over. This is where the choke happens. Because here he could have just kept pressing W at me and it's maybe still had a chance to win because he's fully DR'd and everything. But this is where the choke happens. This is where the choke, he's like, oh my God, we're on YouTube. He's already hearing the YouTube intro. He's already seeing the czar react. Hey guys, you know, he knows at this point. It's just, at this point, you know, I won the mental warfare, it's over. Um, so yeah, at that point, it's just, it is kind of what it is. It is what it is, boys. And that is why we never watch chat. That is why we never, no matter the circumstance, disrespect our opponent. We don't disrespect our opponent with BM root usage like that. And we don't do this. People who, after they kill my teammate and they do this, they give me bloodlust buff IRL. I had a game. I. This happened off stream when I was still testing this stuff, but this is true. This is 100% true. I was playing against a mage and I don't remember what his teammate was, but it was a mage and something, okay? And after, I think it was a mage and a feral. And after CS hero was dead, the mage did the waz walk on CS hero. They were both full HP, why wouldn't he? You know what I did? I killed his fucking teammate. I had 5% HP left. I didn't have bandages. I didn't have Evoglyph. But in my head, this guy murdered one of my family members. He's the worst person in the world. I hate him and I cannot lose. And all of a sudden, you just see me finesse him, running circles in Dalaran all around this guy until I shit on him. And then I didn't say anything. His teammate whispered me. He's like, bro, you can't be doing this to people. You got to take them out for dinner first, man. And I'm like, listen, bro, the moment your mage did the waz walk, that's when it became personal. Before that, I didn't give a shit. I needed to lose rating anyway. But when that happened, oof, you cannot, you cannot disrespect. Be happy, celebrate, but don't fucking disrespect. The moment you disrespect, oof, I don't know what it is, bro. Something happens. I can't explain it. Sounds like Michael Jordan, really? Oh, well, maybe we have that in common. I love the story times. Well, yeah, that's, uh, it is what it is, man. And it became personal. <laughs> yeah.